A busy weekend on the water for tubers and first responders. Rescue crews spent hours out at the Elkhorn River this weekend responding to a wide variety of calls with one thing in common, alcohol. Reporter Miranda Christian has more from the banks of the Elkhorn. This access point just reopened this weekend, so hundreds of people were out here. Now, rescue crews were also busy responding to multiple calls all weekend long. Waterloo and Valley Fire Departments had to rescue at least five people from the Elkhorn River on Saturday. Waterloo Fire says the calls all involved people who were drinking. Rescuers saw injuries, people stranded on sandbars, and even a capsized airboat. That's pretty intense. It's probably because the Elkhorn River was like closed down for a while, so everybody's like, oh, it's back open, let's all go crazy. Daniel Twite says his group of friends will come out to the river a few times during the summer. Everybody's drinking, everybody's having a good time. He says the group knows how to have fun safely. I mean, we're pretty seasoned. I feel like people that do get kind of crazy are the people who don't, you know, do this as often because they don't know. Every tube needs a life jacket. Mike Cross and his group will also take measures to avoid a water rescue. Life vests, uh, and then we tie up a lot of these tubes, hooked together and then stay in groups. You know, when somebody gets singled out, that's where you have problems. And both groups monitor their alcohol consumption. I think it's group effort, yeah. You know, if we see somebody that's a little too much, then we, you know, not cut them off, but, you know, we stick with them extra, you know, give them an extra hand. We have DDs, like I said, we have uh, cars at the end, so we have to have people who are sober. So there are sober people around to take care of people in case uh, that's needed. The NRD says that the water levels are perfectly safe and are okay to be out on. It's just people not being responsible. Reporting at the Elkhorn River, I'm Miranda Christian, KMTV Action 3 News.